as an owner, what are, are you not getting out of dog racing that perhaps we, could be done? Uh, I think the owner should be let, better looked after at tracks. Yeah. In comparison to the horse racing, when you win a race at a horse meeting, you're brought in, you're looked after, and um, it's a definitely a different map. They look after you a lot better if you win a race at a horse, a race at a horse meeting. Um, I think the prize money needs to be looked at. Everyone says that anyway, but it does need looking at. Yeah. Uh, uh, what else would I say? I just find a, I'm not knocking. I know times are hard at the moment and stuff, and it's very hard not be able to go with. Yeah. Uh, find that hard, but that's not there. It's not more their fault. It's not, that's the way it is. Yeah. But I do think um, when it opens back up, um, owners need to be looked at looked after a little bit better. And when you, when you say looked after, what what kind of things are we talking about specifically? If if we said compared it to horse racing. Well, there's some tracks that even charge an owner in. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's ridiculous. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, and they're supplying the effort. You know yeah. what I mean? I, I just, I just, and I know it's only a fiver, whoever it is, but at the same time, it's not how to look after an owner. No. No, not at all. Not at all. And in in terms of, you know, it's, it's, it is rumoured that, that you like a punt from time to time. Um, do you uh, do you have any problems getting a bet on? Do you enjoy getting a bet on? Far too often I can get it on. To be honest with you, obviously online, if it ever goes all online, um, my view is forget about having a bet because you will never get on. Um, yeah. It's that. Um, sooner the better the shops open again, better, in my view. That's interesting. It's interesting. I just think online, online, um, for example, um, like if you're going back with one online, yeah, our price just collapses everywhere. Yeah. It just collapses everywhere. Um, where you're doing, the, like to have a few pounds on you, it's the shops. Mm. Like, in fairness to work, like, if I have a bet, mainly it's for William Hill. Um, I know I know before I walk into the shop I'm down. Yes. Uh, don't refuse me to tell me what I'm down. Yeah. So I but when you go in and look to have a bet in another shop, uh, to don't take the bet and the price is gone, you feel a little bit hard done by. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Yeah, I suppose uh, you're telling me about the about the, the, the times when you have got on that. You kept me very quiet about last weekend at Monmore. I wasn't on. You weren't on. Did did they did the kennel boy not not tip you I, up? I was on Jesse J. Yeah. But, and the war that was more my fault than anything else. Yeah. I was. I done a three hundred pound football bet during the day, and I thought to myself, "Why didn't I do a two hundred pound football bet?" <laughs> <laughs> Was, like t was it two hundred and three to one or something for the treble? Well, it was a lot bigger than that in the morning. Really? A lot bigger than that in the morning. I would say it was closer to three hundred to one in the morning. Yeah. 